previously on Imperion Galactic Survival. Uh, right now, the home towers, we've got less than a day before the next attack. Activate the turrets and weapons. I've got enough fuel, even though our batteries are down. All right, well, it's been almost a whole in-game day, and I have yet to get a warning or anything saying that the Xerox are on their way. I'm going to leave my turrets active, and we're going to go ahead and we're going to start looking for silicon and copper deposits. Um, I'm going to head home. If I find another silicon deposit, I'll just let you guys know once I get back to the base. So I'll see you guys back at the base. We're coming back up on the home towers. Okay, let's slow down and stop. Perfect. Let's movement systems off. Go ahead and hit the power off. Okay. So now we can go ahead and move this stuff over. There's our uh warning all right so we got the warning that we had been waiting for i wonder if i go ahead and sleep if it will uh <laughs> make it day and them arrive or if it will uh just completely delay it i don't know but uh we'll see momentarily when we uh see enemies on our radar slash map here they come they're coming from this direction it looks like we've got rocket drones incoming from this direction let's see if i can take out a rocket drone or two before they get to the base that's a minigun drone uh-oh All right, our turrets are attacking them. All right, there's those. Okay, I think there we go. I don't know if any real damage to the uh, base has occurred. I am severely damaged, however. I'm lucky I didn't die. Let's see. That's one, two, three. Where's the fourth drone? Uh, I don't know where that fourth drone went down. That's one, two, three. I'm pretty sure there were two rocket drones and two minigun drones. I don't see smoke anywhere. It's not that big of a deal. One, two, three. I don't know. Let's head back over here and uh we can actually continue what we were doing even though i'm nearly severely hurt um all right uh let's go back to the player let's put that in here and uh let's get us some uh juice over here i do have a little bit of juice here so we can hear ourselves just a bit okay and we'll get those cooking up and heal ourselves a bit more what does it look like on a timetable now it says next attack is dash so um it won't give us an actual timetable for a little bit probably okay let's put those in here i'll go ahead and put those in there um all right, so now that we've got us some good uh, resources, we can finish the hover vessel 
I want a couple of those. I want another of each of those. Uh, we can't actually go ahead and put a Pentaxa tank on there. And I don't... Yeah, I, I did level. Wow, okay, nice. Um, this, I want to go ahead and get the minigun turrets, ammo container, controller, extension, and that. Let's go ahead and grab that. And I think that's good for now. I think next level, I'm going to go straight down this oxygen station, those two and that, because I do want to put those in the uh, thing. But for now, let's go ahead and get our doors on. Let's connect to this. And I am definitely also, once you get done with those, give me some more hover engines because I'm definitely going to want to put more hover engines on it because uh, I'm going to need them. Okay, so for this, I'm going to put this door a sideways door. Right uh, there. Okay. And actually, let me just tie that into this. What does this say? This is... Uh, well, let's group that, uh, sensors that is in, okay. That's just the interior light. Uh, so okay. Uh, this actually, let me keep this as a single, oh, that's right. Because this is a. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely gonna keep it as a single. Actually. Hmm. Let me do this. Okay. Can you give me another door after all that? Yeah. Okay. All right, and while that's working, we'll go ahead, uh, home towers. We will go ahead and add the fuel tank and generator to where they are going to go. Let's see, generator there. Honestly, I probably should have put the generator generators on the side there, but I'm not terribly worried about that. Um, and full tank there. Okay. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, I didn't put the generator in the right place. Let's go ahead. I mean, it's in the right place, just not the right, uh, orientation. So let's go ahead. Okay, because I like having it with that. And let's pop it this way. There we go. So that is mirroring that. This doesn't have to mirror quite so much with that. So I'm not too worried about that. Um, okay, we are definitely going to want to go ahead and utilize this these and I'm definitely going to want to go ahead and put that in and these so this we're going to put there um, I'm going to want some more sensor blocks okay let's do this let's do two more of that let's do we're definitely going to want to the hover vessel thing there uh i'm gonna want start uh let's do the ore and wood container controller and then that six and then can i make the minigun i can let's do one minigun is all i'm really going to want to put on it and then we're going to want to get the ammo container and then 
a couple more of those. And I've got some bullets in the back that I can utilize. Let's go ahead, get this. And eventually I might put some drills on it as well. Okay, so uh, in the front here, let's do this and then that so we can put the uh, harvester on the front there. Did you take damage? You didn't take any damage. It just looked kind of weird. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead. Oh, let's activate the movement systems and levitate this so I can get under and put these. Uh, put these other engines in. Um, I was going to put one. Now, I was going to put them. Okay, they're covered up with that. So let's put this one there, there, here, here, and then I'll probably end up putting generators here and there. Um, back here, I know I'm going to want some more, uh, let's see. I'm going to want some more uh, hover engines back here. Let's see where am I going to want them. Uh, I'm going to want to do that and that. And we're going to put some on the outside here. And then actually, let me do this. There, 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 and there. So I've only got one left because I put four there. Can I make some more? Probably. All right, let's go ahead and make these three more. Uh, while I'm waiting on that, we will go ahead and refit all this. Okay. Oh, we got a lot of stuff to do now. Okay. Um, for this, we're going to go ahead and utilize some of this to repair the front here. Uh, let's see. I need this for in here. And then this. Ah, crap. There. Okay, so we got the front repaired. Next. There we go. Uh, next, we're going to do some interior building. And let's grab that back. We've got these still waiting on one more. Um, what we're going to do in here... Let's see, uh, the middle one is the ore and wood, so I want it up here, like so. Uh, the, that one is, all right, that's the ammo, so that's the regular container controller. We're going to put it there. Like that. And then for ammo, I'm probably going to put the ammo over here. So let's go ahead and I'm wondering if I should just use one fridge. I think I'm just going to keep one fridge there. And we're going to put the ammo controller here. And I'll grab a third one to put there. Go ahead and give me this. Um... Connect to this and uh, that's weird. Okay, and give me one more of these. All right, let's grab this 
Oh, because that was the habitat controller. <laughs> Weird. Okay, anyway. So there, now we've got 500 ammo value. We've got 625 input value. Weird. Because that has three connected. That's got four and it's just a little bit and three and 75. Okay, yeah, that's over. They're 25 each. Duh. Now, we are going to set this. Hold on, let's group everything. You are the constructor input. You are the constructor output. And you, of course, are just the ammo box. So, okay. Next, we are going to put this here. Interactive controller it. Okay, and we're going to put it out to the edge of this. Let's go ahead and widen it a little. Actually, no, let's not. Let's keep it narrow because, I mean, eh, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Let's widen it like that because I'll be ac accessing this from here probably. So, okay. You are going to be door and ramp. So now I can do door and ramp. And you are door and ramp. So now the door and ramp activates like so. Perfect. Okay. Um, in fact, with this, there we go. Let me make you a little bit wider and go out a little bit further. Okay. So now, ah, crap. Why is it doing that? I don't know. Okay. This is weird. Okay. Uh, you see how that thing's fritzing out like it is? I don't know why it does that. It sometimes does that. Okay. So now we've got this that I want to key into this because everything here I should be be accessing from like back here then if I come here the doors will open and let's go ahead and oh I can't make it go back any further that's right uh let me do this instead Okay, uh, let's put the sensor on this because I'm just going to have it be three wide anyway. So, all right, and all right, let's see how that is. Now, I don't want it that high let's just make it like so and so well that that ought to be okay so when I come under it it'll open let's make it uh, down to here just because okay so now We are going to call you uh, roof access port, and we are going to key you into the roof access port. So back here, 
I'm doing my stuff. Everything's fine. Nothing is uh, activating. I need to get out. Bada bing, bada boom. Roof access port. Okay. Now, I go into here. When I pop out, automatically. There we go. Now that's how you do it. Okay. So, last things last, or I guess next things next. Uh, let's put one, two, three, four, and then re add these. Like so. All right. Everything appears to make this perfectly level now. Now, I don't yet really really you're you're going to attack really why come on over here i guess you can't and i ruined my floor okay uh now the one thing ow the one thing we forgot to add, or a couple of things we forgot to add, uh, this I want to go in the front, and then, <laughs> um, okay, it's floating on the cricket. <laughs> um, also. I need to make sure that these are added to the movement systems. I, I need to add all of the hover engines to the movement systems because that's why I was hovering uh, like I was. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. And then hover engines here. Make sure to add everything that's not movement system. Do the movement systems. What? I've got a damaged one. How did that happen? The cricket. <laughs> Probably the cricket. Okay. Uh, movement systems on, forward, and down. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Cricket's inside. All right, so the next thing that I want to do is I want to add the turret. Now, I want to put the turret relatively in the middle. So let's just do this. Okay. And I want it... like so and i want it to face forward there you are now because of this these are all gonna have to change to accommodate the new shape okay so let's go ahead and do that. And I'm going to do some symmetry here. Like so. Just to make it a little easier on myself. Okay. And... You and there. Okay. So now we have this. And for now, I'm going to utilize that to activate and deactivate the weapon systems. So with it collapsed, and then we have it 
Pop up. Yeah. All right. So we have our turret. Um, ammo's going to be in here. Let me... Let me see if I have... Go to all. Yeah, that's what I need. Okay. Now I'm going to do some texturing on my own. Um, in the meantime, let's go check out what damage occurred from this attack. We lost... I don't think we took any damage, to be honest, to the base. Because I think I was distracting them. And uh, I think the base came out uninjured, which is nice. Because we had this attacking, that attacking. Now that's the second time that the... Uh, the attack has come from that direction so that probably means that I uh, that is where the primary attack headquarters or whatever is so okay then now uh, I was saying I wanted to add RCSs and stuff to this I'll do a lot of that upgrading and stuff later possibly off camera but in the meantime I'm enjoying this uh hover vessel now i've got enough hover thruster or hover engines inside of it so that we can carry a decent amount i'm eventually going to probably replace this up here with another one of these maybe down here as well but probably just the top ones and uh if I do, I'll probably extend this all the way up to there so that it covers the entirety of this. I don't know. Um, it, it, it's all up for discussion. And uh, like I said, I'm probably going to put these out back out this direction. But in any case, you better not attack my hover vessel. Um, I might end up turning these into ramps. I don't know. In any case... We've done quite a bit today, and so that's going to be it for this episode. I hope everybody enjoys the episode, or enjoyed the episode. If you did, hit that like button for me. And if you want to see more Imperion Galactic Survival, go ahead and subscribe. I'm Know-It-All DM, and as always, y'all have a good day now.